guess you could say got lucky to get reimbursed to some of the efforts that we've been doing for so long, you know, and so that's good. I'm glad we, and that is taxpayers' money. But other than that, it's through, it's really through the care and compassion of so many people in the United States that we're able to do what we do. Mine, I don't know the exact numbers right now because we actually still talking because the reimbursement is not 100% given to us yet. It was just something we submitted to. I, I think it was like a, we have requested like a, a little bit over a million dollars, you know, and uh, but I don't know that we've received it 100%, you know, but yes, uh, it's possible that we could even get more, but we're working on that. It's not outlandish to say there are some people that just cannot afford a plane ticket. There are some people now. Now, how does Catholic Charities help with either a bus ticket or a plane ticket as I mean, because you have got to get them. To a destination is there is there an agreement there what how does that work no no agreement you know we we definitely encourage for the family to be able to come up with that ticket that transportation and so we'll wait to make sure that that happens if we start paying for tickets and everybody's going to need a ticket you know nobody's going to be able to come up because more than likely more the families are borrowing the money to buy that ticket and so they need to make that effort and so we really definitely uh, encourage that and and pretty much if we end up paying uh any tickets it will be because um maybe less than one percent of everybody that we get you know very few peak cases in, that we will definitely follow up and and get somebody to sponsor that family you know but mm -hmm. that's what that's how we do it we we usually get uh almost a hundred percent of people paying their own their own transportation